Good evening. I have a few announcements before Brian Norris has our invitation tonight. On the sick list, continuing member Doris Newman, she has been moved to Huntsville, to Health South Rehab, and would enjoy some visits. Her visiting hours are 4 to 5 o'clock. Also, Totsie Sanders, um, they're pretty sure Totsie has lung cancer. He still has some uh, additional testing to go through here in the near future, but he is at home and would appreciate any cards, visits, or phone calls. This Sunday, we plan to offer uh, blood pressure testing. If that in mind, if you're able to use a blood pressure cuff, please see David or Jill Robinson, and we'll have a few more details in uh, Sunday's bulletin for that. Lads to leaders, the mass media stuff and the music uh, items are due to be turned in. They need to be postmarked by Monday. If you're working on mass media and have something to turn in, please get that to Rob Lenore. If you're entering in the music category, please turn that into Carrie as soon as possible. Tonight, the song of invitation is number 766. 766. Zach Hawkins will lead our closing prayer. Brian. If you'll be turning chap Matthew chapter 5, we'll be there in a moment. I have a charcoal smoker, uh, stands about as high as this podium, it's 22 inches in diameter, and with uh, some attention, some work, you can make some pretty good food on it. And usually I open it up and it's black and charcoal gray inside, some silver parts. And a couple of weeks ago I opened it up and it was blue and green and rusty brown. And fluffy white inside and uh, sat there and started scrubbing on it and cleaning it up and thinking you know what why did this happen and I'm always good to clean the grates and the water bin everything that might get uh, food on it while while I'm cooking but I hadn't noticed that the meat had dripped down the sides before I put it up and so it gotten dirty inside and, and uh, I also got to thinking you know, do I clean my my sin like that? Do I do I scrub the things that I think are important, and leave things that I don't think people will see dirty? And when I get in trouble with sin, that that's what happens. I leave things dirty in my lives that in my life that I don't think people can see, and it goes a little further and. I let something else get dirty because I don't think somebody will see that. And it, it just kind of rolls up. And uh, that's where we find, find the Pharisees in Matthew chapter 5. And Jesus warns people on the Sermon on the Mount that their righteousness has to exceed the righteousness of the Pharisees. Because they don't, they don't bother to clean the insides. You know, they, they instruct people in, in verse 21. Yeah, you've heard it said that that it, you've heard that it was said by them of old time, "Thou shalt not kill," and whoever shall kill.